Uh, crypto traders who prefer self-custody could be in for a treat. Following the latest MetaMask development, the wallet reportedly added support for the ThorChain decentralized protocol. Uh, ThorChain has been working towards solving the challenge of cross-chain trading in DeFi. Uh, cross-chain trading is easy on centralized exchanges. However, it is a uh, tall order in the decentralized segment since most decentralized protocols um, are um, usually limited in the ability to communicate to um, multiple blockchains. Uh, um, the announcement that ThorChain was now compatible with MetaMask meant ThorChain was now closer to realizing its full potential. Uh, and you don't know that, you know what, of course, is a very misting. So, I mean, if you're, if you're just kind of clear there, um, then if you're just misting is so excited, you can see some of them when you're seeing how we're... This means that tens of millions can now easily trade crypto using a decentralized protocol instead of a centralized exchange. This is huge news, but few are paying attention. Uh, Joe Valenzuela at the Desert Links, September 15th, uh, 2023. Uh, MetaMask has over 30 million users across the globe and is one of the most popular crypto self-custody wallets. Um, its integration with ThorChain might be a game changer for the protocol. This is because the integration offers a new avenue through which MetaMask users can conduct swaps in a self-custody environment. ThorChain's integration with MetaMask highlights the shifting dynamics of the crypto trading landscape. The collapse of multiple centralized exchanges sheds light on the risk of a custodial approach rather than a self-custody approach. And ThorChain's native cryptocurrency room seems to have extended its previous bullish momentum following the announcement. This suggested that the bulls gained more confidence now that ThorChain was accessible through MetaMask. Uh, Rune exchanged hands at $1.82 at press time after pulling off a 13% upside in the last 24 hours. Uh, it was up by roughly 26% from its current weekly low. However, traders should be on the lookout for the resurgence of sell pressure. And now that the cryptocurrency is approaching overbought territory, as can be seen below. Uh, furthermore, a bit more upside will put Rune in the same resistance range uh, where it registered sell pressure during its August rally. Uh, as far as in on-chain data was concerned, that a substantial surge uh, was seen in uh, investor confidence, judging uh, by uh, the weighted sentiment uptick. Uh, the weighted sentiment metric at press time was at its highest level in the last seven days. The same applies to the volume metric, which revealed that volume has ever been growing for the last few days. Of course, it helps that the overall market conditions have been improving in favor of the bulls. Uh, Rune's latest rally further builds on its rally, which kicked off in mid-June. Uh, moreover, uh, the rally could extend, especially now that ThorChain's prospects just hit a new highest step. It is now more likely to experience uh, more demand through MetaMask. Uh, 